The big one, the 335, the Skybet Ebor Handicap over the extended one mile and five furlongs. Sweet William, all the rage at five to two. A wonderful renewal of this fantastic race. And racing for the Skybet Ebor 2023 Enemy and Sun chart with the slowest to begin. Get Shirty will be dropped in from his outside draw. But it's Berkshire Rocco that emerges as the early pace setter, though. He's right up there. Semhan prominent as well for Holly Doyle on the outside. And Keith Chorister among the leading trio, too, with Jack Finbar on the inner racing in fourth. Ryan is keeping Real Dream handy, but much wider on the outside. And Frankie is tracking him. The two uh, big guns on the outside there from their high draws, maintaining space away from the main group on the inside of the race course. So Berkshire Rocco leads them down the far side of the course here. Close up Semhan together with Keys Chorister and Live Your Dream in the Blue Jacket. Jack Findbar is on the rail. Just coming across now, Real Dream and Absurd to join the leading group. Post Impressionist is just chasing the leaders. Yashin up there as well alongside HMS President. Uh, Sweet William in the middle of the field next to the rail. Script Riders on the outside then of the Yellow Jacket there of adjuvant in the rear third of the field scampi's also in that little cluster as well saratoga gold is next uh, followed then by tash khan towards the back still in the green jacket is ocean wind as they continue over on the far side of the race course and head down now towards the final seven furlongs of the contest sun chart still waited with and get shirty whips them in probably about 12 lengths separating first and last then as they go past the halfway point in the Skybet Ebor of 2023. Real Dream on the outside of Berkshire Rocco with racing in third then Semhan the pale blue cap Jack Finbar and his stable mate Absurd in fourth and fifth the team Mullins followed by Keys Chorister white with the blue cross belts then post impressions Love Your Dream Yashin and scriptwriter. Sweet William is next to the rail traveling strongly in the pink jacket followed through behind these by Adjiv who's getting closer you can Glenn is next with scampi tracking him on the inside enemy wiki wiki wheels tash Khan, ocean wind on the outer and then sun chart and get shirty whip them in down they come in the home straight here in the ball past the four furlong marker they go real dream and Berkshire Rocco having a good set two for the lead here on the near side is absurd and Frankie going great guns Yashin is chasing hard though up the inside post impressionist and sweet William is gathering ahead of steam as well being held together by Rab Havlin right behind them Scampi's looking for room and they race up towards the final two and a half furlongs here and it's absurd and Frankie Dettori who strike the front in the e-ball Sweet William down the centre with Love Your Dream in between them Live Your Dream rallying bravely back and forth Berkshire Rocco as they race up inside the final furlong a three way go absurd on the near side Sweet William and Live Your Dream in between them this is going to be desperately close absurd and Frankie though just goes on to win on his final ride at York. Absurd has won the e for Frankie. Sweet William second. Right behind them was Live Your Dream. And a whole host behind running on post impressionists with Berkshire Rocco, script writer. Tight for the minor placings. Frankie does it again. Well, the script wrote itself. Absurd and Frankie Dettori on his last ride at the York e Festival win the Skybet e -ball. Sweet William in second, Live Your Dream third, and you can Glenn in fourth. But Absurd has done the business and has very much taken advantage of both Frankie the Tory's skill and experience in the saddle and that golden highway on the near side rail. Sweet William had every chance in the centre of the track, but it was Frankie the Tory and Absurd, the excess stamina, the surplus staying power of Absurd that has just come out on top in a thriller of a finish to this year's Sky Bet Ebor. A cracker that can only have had one result, Frankie on fire. <laughs> Frankie de Tori is admiring his own white teeth there. <laughs> I'm sure they're whiter than mine. Anyway, 187 winners he's signing off with here at York. Three e -bores, and he's just won on absurd. And we were just talking when Kinross won the city yes. of York. I was complimenting you on the quality of your scriptwriter. He has definitely gone, he or she has definitely gone absurd now. Don't you think this is extraordinary? Yeah, I mean, I thought from 24, got no chance. Also, it's cover. It likes to run through horses. I was the whitest of all, we know cover, and hit the front three out. And I thought, I think, I think Willie's not going to be too pleased with you. But, you know, you got to deal with the cards you dealt. And, uh, and we, you know, we went fast in the beginning. We didn't go that mad in mid-race. And he wanted to go right. And I thought, God, I'm not going to fight him. So let's get the fence. And I got the fence, and he was willing to run for me. So I let him kick on, and I knew he stays well. 
And uh, when Wright came off the well, I'm a sit sitting duck here, I'm going to get beat. But, you know, in fairness, he p stuck his neck out and he won. Okay. He won going away. Yeah. Tena yeah, tenacious in the yeah. end. It's a win and you're in race for the Melbourne Cup. Would you advise to take to join Vauban down under? Well, he's, you know, I'm sure then he's going, you know, when you win and you win the chance to go. You know, it depends what weight he's got. I'm definitely going. <laughs> and depends yeah, if he has my weight. But, you know, he's won an Ebo, so you've got to consider it. And what a way to yeah. end your career here yeah. at York with two wins in the last two races. Can you imagine? I couldn't write it. I thought Kid Ross was my best and, uh, you know, to top it up with Ebo, what can you say? Amazing. I don't have to imagine it. I've just seen it. <laughs> and two flying distance within the space yeah. of two. How are the knees within yeah. the space of two races? My legs are knackered because I had to run him all the way to the yes, start. Yes, I know. I know he did. Yeah, he didn't look like he was in the mood. I know. He's like that. Willie Cine does in the morning. Somebody said, come on, jump on it. So you must be crazy. I'm knackered. <laughs> <laughs> Keep your leg up instead. <laughs> now I'm easy. Well, it's been a fabulous career here in York and uh, I couldn't ask for a better finish. Congratulations. I Thank look you. forward to whatever ridiculous next chapter in your signing off, whatever it's going to be. Exactly. Thank you, Lydia. <laughs> Thank right. you. It is Willie Mullins who has supplied Absurd to uh, give Frankie de Tori a signing off win here at the York Ebor Festival in the Ebor itself and quite a marvellous.